Welcome back everybody, my name is Modra, and some people call me Anki and we are getting back into Seven Days to Die where we're looking at the loot that we've got to sell I uh, don't think there was anything else here Okay, I have got a sprained leg so I've got to take this reasonably easy so we're just going to make a nice quiet way over to the trader there wasn't uh, a huge amount of uh, loot last night but uh, yeah they certainly did do some damage uh, to the spikes it was a great idea putting them down there but yeah this this place is coming along really nicely i've still got to figure out some sort of entrance way to that uh yeah let's go to the trader first let me uh, let me just check something we want to have a look and see what if we've got the landmine book which was Sorry, perk books, and it was um, urban combat, isn't it? So, this one here. I need number five. So, I still need the Sakar book in this book. So, we really, really need to find ourselves the perk books. We haven't had much luck at finding the Sakar one. I finally got the mini bike one. Oh, what am I doing? Talking about the mini bike, I can actually go fast on the mini bike without breaking my leg. It is getting low on gas, so we'll top it up. We were going to be... Well, he restocked yesterday, didn't he? Do I even check his restock? I'm not even sure. But yeah, uh, if we get that... If we get that book for the landmines, I'm thinking about moving to the wasteland. I don't really want to go over there now. There's some of these. Oh, we got a nice wee fat stack of cash now. I'll bring you over so I know what I've got. And I don't remember if I've got an advanced bellows. So we are looking for those perk books, which I don't think he sells anyway. And I'm just having a quick look to see what else he's got. Not really anything. Uh, jumping out at me at the moment. Gratitude okay. and safe travels, friend. And do you have any jobs? He's got a close fetch. Let's I do that. Admire you for I can't thank you enough. Oh, who was it? Oh, I forgot. I'm just checking to make sure it's not our wood base. I know, a bit further away. Okay. Yeah, so hopefully. If fingers crossed and everything goes the way I want them to go, I need to find the cigar book and the landmine book. I actually think they're both in the in the urban combat, aren't they? Yeah, I need number two and number five. So urban combat books. So finding a cracker book would be good, but there is none here in this village. So, I need to find myself a bigger city. I haven't found one yet, but now I've got a bike, I don't mind venturing a wee bit further. So we'll just do this one quest, and then we might go on a wee exploration. So, we're just going to go straight into the mist, and... Oh, don't run. I don't want to hurt that leg even more. We are looking for this satchel. Which is right there. I bet you're going to be locked to run. Anyway, oh, I've got crossbow bolts in there. I'll just scrap them. And what have I got iron there for as well? Oh, the shotgun was there, that's right. I'll just move some stuff around a wee bit so I don't get confused again. I'll keep the shotgun just for the wood knights. Just for ammo stuff. Yeah, I thought you might have been locked. So we're going to break our way in here. And I half expect you to be concrete. And it's not going to take us too long to get into here. So we'll just get in here and get the satchel. I know it's a wee bit of a cheesy way of doing things. But the game allows me to do it, so I'm going to do it. Plus, I really want to get over to finding a decent sized village anyway. 
is wandering hold. Oh, I got sneak damage on them too. And you. Take that guys. I'm not sneaking anymore so I can probably stand up. They already know I'm here killing their friends. Yeah, you're right there mister. Yeah, I'm sorry but I think it's already a bit late for you. They're a wee bit beyond your help. So we will learn this. I think I'm actually a little bit hurt. There must be been left over from Horde Knight, so we use that. I will use the coffee straight away. And I might eat something straight away too. I am a little bit hungry and thirsty. I've still got one minute before I can run. Might have a quick look at this police car. I have got a few lockpicks now. Oh, look. Urban combat, please. That's not urban combat. Look. You gotta learn how to spell it right. Oh well. So we'll have a couple of goes again into here. I don't want to like waste all of my lot picks. But it's always good getting into the cop cars for the ammo. Oh my started getting my hopes up there that I was gonna get through in one. And instead there's you gotta be kidding me. Okay, maybe I'm going to break them all on the first cop car I see. Come on. Wow, six broken ones. You better be worth it. Okay, I'll, I'll sell you. I might even buy some more lot picks. And, okay. Oh, don't jump. Your leg still hurt. So we're heading, handing this quest in. And... <laughs> Seeing how far we are with the um, trader routes. Well, you're a sight for you did it. So, Great job, traveler. We'll keep getting the books uh, and inventory. I'll sell you straight away. Peace be with you, my uh, friend. What other job do you have? We'll pick this one up. Would you kindly help me with a little problem? Actually, okay, maybe next time. Yeah, no, I will. Safe travels, pick friend. it up. I like you, friend. I'm probably not going to do it just yet. Makes us friends now. It's basically in the same place where I was before. But I'm thinking that that village is not very big. This one's not very big. It kind of looks like we have to go this way or this way. I don't think I'm really kitted out for the snow list. Let's have we, we look at my uh, cold resist. Uh, okay, I don't find any. It must be in this one. Cold resist. 31. Uh, I'm not sure if that's enough. What books do you have? Mm. Not really anything that I was particularly after. But okay, so let's, let's go to here. We are looking for sugar butts. I'm gonna buy one. I might buy a learning lecture as well. So next old night I'll try and get as many levels as I can. I'm not going to that quest just yet. I'm gonna head to my waypoint. I need to explore a little bit more and, and get these books. These books are really holding me back. And the winter biome has a higher loop stage. We'll just check that, check it right now. So at the moment we're on 73. When I start freezing my ass off, we'll have another look. I'm wet. And we're now on 154, so we doubled our loop stage for coming here. Right, there's a Waypoint, and we just oh, we have already got one. Okay, we're getting to them. <laughs> okay, sometimes it pays to look a bit further. Oh, get off there.
we'll just get your loot from out here. Get that uh, forged head book. Get the extra little bit of gas. Oh, you also had one. That's nice and handy. But there should also be one in here. That's 41 out of 50. Okay, you can stay bashing in the way in there. You're not going to make it in anyway. And there's a couple more books in here. Oh, I thought the door was locked for a sec. But wait, I can't get in. We'll get these books. And there should be another one on the other side. Come on, I need the urban combat. You're look well that didn't take long. Nice work. Thank you. So we'll check her job. She's got a couple really quick. Oh, this is the best um, way to do hurry. Pictures. So we'll do that. Up soon. And quickly, really fast, have a look through her box in here. Oops, that was a handy forge to head. I might buy it. Uh do I buy that as well? No, that's not just yet. Scrapping cigar. Buy it. She had a cigar. That is awesome. I hope you get feeling better. So I should be able to wear this. Which gives me come back. Which gives me strength plus one and bartering. Buttering is okay, but the strength plus one is what I really needed for Pummel Pete. There we go. We've now got that maxed out, which uh, gives us 30 stamina back and there's 100% uh, more damage in successive, three successive hits. That's really great. And I can max out some of the other things if I wanted to, but I also need to keep my eyes on this. For that I need intellect 10 which could take a wee while. It's going to be quite expensive to get to but that's something to work towards. Uh, there's one more book over here. There we go. Tools. And we might use this one while we've got that open. Okay. Oh and money. Hey Jen, I um I forgot to sell you some old cash if you want it. It's um it was mine. I had it with me when I got here. I really did not find it anywhere here. I, I really did already have it. Here you now go. That was a good deal. Trust me. So this quest is just there. I will check a little bit more of this. Oh it was right next door. That's handy. And there's two mailboxes. Let's get both of these. Come on, urban combat. No. Urban Combat. Although I don't need Urban Combat 2 anymore, I only need Urban Combat 5. Urban Combat 5. No. Yeah, so... I don't know this POA. Well, we'll loot the vehicles. And this was just to fetch, so I can do this quite quickly. You know what? Let's save some ammo. We'll bash some heads with our new pummel pit. What? Stupid birds. You two. Oh, red. Come on, die already. The reds are quite a lot tougher than normal. Oh, there's two of them there. Whoa! Lady, settle down there. I'm trying to deal with this feral. Wow. Okay, I dealt with them. So what do we got? Uh, we'll just use this straight away. Pipe shotgun four. Wow. I've got a pumpy back at the place. Oh. Nothing else really in here. Toilet. Oh, I'll check the toilet in case there's an upgraded pistol. I might need to start doing some farm blocks too. Ok, 
and I have to loot you anyway because you give me a little bit of resistance. But can I even put you in? I can. That helps a little bit. It's not great for the snow, it's more heat resistance, but it does have four cold resistance, so that's okay. Get encumbered already. Right, we should get this actually, because we can leave any time once I've got this. There we go. I'm going to have a bit more of a look around. Hey, because we are in the higher loot level. Hoping for some good stuff. Like like a um upgraded pistol, you know? No? Okay. Uh corn milk can fuck off. Actually they can fuck off. I'm gonna scrap both of them. I can always do a vehicle uh wrenching run if I need them. Oh hello. Get back in there. You weren't finished yet. Take that. And your friend too. Whoa, I missed. Oof. Um, yeah. You had some raspberry juice coming out of the top of your head there, buddy. And not too much. The repair kits are good though. I will check this um, working stuff van uh, or truck. Oh, there's a beer. Watch out for the beer. Just ignore me. Okay, lot picks are handy. We'll get out of here. Or is this? This is not the same one, is it? Oh, I don't think it is. No, it's untouched. Oh, I forgot. There was a um. Damn it, I forgot. I have to go back to the other one because there is a concrete mixer here too. And the concrete mixers always have forged head books. I have to look to see where the other one was. We'll get that on the way back to Jen. I'll get the sand as well. I'm not sure how much of it I have at home. So, where are we now? We are there. The other one is here. I'll go and get that forged head book. That was just me being forgetful. So that other concrete mixer should be right here. And the cement as well, of course. So we'll use this one. And we'll use this one. And get this wee bit of concrete and sand. Hey you. Face down in the snow where you belong. Nah, stay there. I know there's all sorts of vehicles and stuff here that I could loot, but they don't really give me the books. So if you do I have room? Fly, no? I've got the best selection um, of medicine in the wasteland. Here's your pay for a job well done. Okay, uh, I think I'll stick with the shotgun demo. Yeah. And never mind. We are not sticking here, Jen. Sorry, but uh, your village is kind of lacking what I need. So, bye. Okay, so we got the wasteland here. Or part of it, anyway. Hey, look. Stop it. And there's another one. Yeah. Oh, damn. Not very good at shooting them at the moment. Aim's a little bit off. Okay, so we're in the wasteland, which is dangerous. But if I stick to the roads, I'm hoping there's not going to be any land ones. And hopefully this... 
I don't know what is going to happen. This could be a really silly idea. And looking at their um, game stage, we're at 195. Okay, we've got a couple of different ways to go here. I'm going to take the south one. I should probably check these cars. It's probably not a silly idea. I mean, we're in the highest game stage, so it makes sense, yeah? Whatever, I'm going to drop some stuff on the bike if I've got room. Because I don't even know if I emptied it. It's okay. Yeah, you stay on me. I'm more likely to see you. Right now I can actually walk a bit freer. Take that. We're just going to make sure there's no zombies here first. Hey. Well, there's quite a few here. Nothing's really uh, too scary though. Well, scary as in they are zombies, but um... Nothing too difficult, I should say. And we'll get some uh, wasteland looting going on here. I hear footsteps. There was a vehicle book. And they're probably on the... They could be on the bridge above me. They may not even know I'm here, so... Poncho for the hot weather. I don't really want it though. I like the... Um, College jacket. Oh, he made it down. Okay, can you get into this cop car like now? Like super quick? Damn it. I didn't break the lockpick. It, it did it itself. I would have sat here and waited for him to bash me. Okay, so we'll get some more ammo hopefully. Okay, and a drink. Okay, for wasteland loot, that actually wasn't that great. And the beer, that's oh, what I missed. Another vehicle book. Okay, so that's what I got, another thing i got to be careful of, these things. They are so tough. So, I should probably just get out of here, but in the meantime I'll read those books. And a jacket that kind of sells. I'll get rid of coffee seeds for now, but I'll get them back later. I might even just drink this drink actually. And we'll just drop some stuff in there that I can. We'll just carry on. We're going to avoid that beer. I got to keep a little bit of an eye on the time. And my guess, apparently, it's quite low. Hey you. Hey, I might use the bandage. Oh, there's another beer. And a cop. Okay, well, I'm not stopping for these cars. I probably should have taken the cop route, but let's just. Hopefully, the beer didn't see us. And we'll look at the map again to see if this is still taking us home. Well, they're looking at my compass up top. I'm heading directly home. So I guess worse comes to worse. Oh, this road hopefully joins up here. Because I don't know, maybe there's an intersection here. Oh, and there's snow. I should have just looked a little bit longer. Okay, so I can come to this part of the wasteland okay. Which means to do what I was thinking of next. It might not even be that far out of the option even without that book okay so yeah here's another one of those intersections interesting still got a little bit of time though so i'll open that up on the map so i can see what it is and i might go back into the wasteland for a little bit it's a broken one so i can't actually traverse over it Got a big break in the middle, but I know that link's here and that link's here, and we're going to see what this one takes us. Oh, 
I'm going to put a waypoint on my base so I can see how far away it is. Okay, let's quick scout, see if there's no any... There's a beer. To see if there's any landmines. Landmines are one of my biggest threats here. That's why I wanted that Urban Combat 5 book for. Man, I'm not really getting the loot that I was hoping for. Quick scout for landmines again. They use usually we red dot on the landmines. If you can see them. I don't very often see them until I hear the click that they've got to blow up. And I'll be quite sad if this Horde Every Night series finished because I stood on a landmine. And the car. Checking the cars for hopefully upgraded tools. These bears are also very scary. Yeah, the thunder has started. I'm going to have to start turning around and going home. It's not been a very eventful day, but I'm getting prey and exploring. I didn't look for landmines that time, so it was a wee bit risky. Okay, we're going to top up with a wee bit of gas I've got. Okay, this looks like a village up ahead. I'll, I'll open this up. If it is a village, it could be just a checkpoint. I don't see any other buildings. It's probably just a checkpoint. Okay. This was a store. I'll check this car and then I think I'm going to have to start heading back home. This is really not going uh, the way I wanted. I still never found my city. Uh, I got still got a little bit of time, but let's keep going a little bit longer. We haven't got anything that I would consider uh, an upgrade or anything to make this really worthwhile, so I'm still hoping. Oh, oh. Copper and a beer. Just ignore me. I said ignore me. Go away. I'm not in your territory. And there's too many things following me, so I'm not going to stop that car. Now, here I've got a problem. Uh, let's get further and further away from home. Let's check this truck. I really want to stick to the roads. Damn, still no upgrade. I'll check there. I am going to check. Because it looks like there's some buildings, which means it could be the start of the city. I do not have time to make a base here. But if I open this up, and have a real quick look through it, I might be able to work on that on another day. Alright, so this is definitely the start of what looks like a bigger village, or bigger city. This is finally a decent looking city, pity it's in the middle of the wasteland. We will, uh, we will seriously consider uh, making a move over here, uh, maybe in the next day or two. I just need to, need to get home now. I can't stop him too much. Um, 
I need to go back down that road. I hope I've given myself enough time to get home. Which road? There's a trader. Oh no, that was the wrong button. Oh come on, I don't have time for this. Save waypoint. Um, I'll just call it T for now. And no more mucking about. No more mucking about. Let's just get home. And avoiding the bears and the landmines. And everything else that's really, really nasty out here. I got one hour to get home and I'm still 1.3 k's away. It is going to be very tight. It's still going to be very close. Although we are now 250 meters away. And we've got 15 minutes to get home. Still very, very, very close. I can see the building. I can see the top of the building. But we're going to make it. Confident we're going to make it. I'm not going to really have time to do any uh, loot. Oh, come on. 52. And are we going to get time? No, I need the shotgun, so I'll deal with the rest of it later. Oh, I'm encumbered. Let's get up there. We're so close. Dump everything. Dump everything, and we're now on Horde Night. Wow. Talk about cutting it fine. I'll bring the crossbow down, just, I mean the crossbow, the bow and arrow down. But yeah, we made it. I'm going to repair the pistol, in case I need that. Okay, I might even see if I can get a few quick shots with this before we get too busy. And I missed the first one, so. And I didn't redo any spikes or anything, so. This is going to be a bit of an interesting one. Alright, let's go to the shotgun. Oh, I didn't even get more shotgun shells. Oh, we've got a wee few. Okay, let's stick with the bat. We're low on ammo and twice a cop. Not that gun for the cops. This one. Take that. Come on. Oh, there's another cop. Oh, that's the wrong gun. I'm not sure we killed him, but... I didn't even get my uh, 7.62 ammo out. I might have to go do that. Should be just here. I'll take out that extra... Just in case. Oh, wee. I'm still... Uh, still haven't got sorted from the, the late arrival. Bye. <laughs> Put an arrow in them and then the sledge snuffs them away. I didn't even repair or anything. Let's have a quick look at that. Uh, we're okay. Right, let's do some more pummel peak. We got the maximum pummel peak now, so let's make use of it. Miss the doggy. There you go, sit back down. Oh, oh give me my arrow back. Hey. Alright, uh, time to calm down a little bit. Calm down as I'm smashing brains. Zombie brains. Oh, three dogs in a row. Did he die? Not sure. Oh, and we've got... What? We've got a bird above somewhere. Hey. Take that. Well, it's hit one on fire, but I don't think I really hit him. I've got the doggo, that's for sure. Luke. Oh yeah, I'm actually hungry and thirsty. 
Eat. Drink. Smash. Smash him. Come on. You gotta pop some more heads. Thank you. Oh, I missed. I should stop using that gun, the ammo is reasonably low. Popping them all. Hey, stop it! Where did he go? Not over the wall. Yeah, if I had spiked in there, you'd also be dead. Oh, another copper. And you guys are annoying. What happened to that copper? He blew up. I must have knocked him off the wall. There's another one. Hey look, out of the way. I can't see what I'm doing yet. So you need repaired. Repair. Oh come on, there's a co he's right there. Come on. I think there's another one there. Oh no, one of them blew up. Hey you. Why did you not bash her off? Yeah, see, that's better. That's doing your job right. Smash. Are we thinning them out finally? 
Oh, I'm really, really hurt. Let's take another first aid kit. Okay, I might even take both of them. And, um... No, I should be right. What are you doing trying to crawl through those bars? Take that. Smash. All that armor means nothing when you lose your head. Loot. I just cannot let it go. If I see loot, I have to get it. Um, I'm actually fatigued. Is it Titans that do that? I think it is. Yes. I think we're thinning out a wee bit. Let's go back to the pirate for a sec. Oh. <laughs> I thought I was going to get this guy in front, but I didn't. I've got his mate behind him. Now that missed. That didn't. In the back of the head too. Hey, I missed. One of my arrows? No. Oh, you're already eating one arrow. Here's another one. Are you full yet? Okay, and there's the morning chime. We're going to go down to see what's going on around here. Pick up some arrows. Pick up some loot. And we've got that same problem. They're underground again. That is such a silly wee, wee bug, whatever is causing that. I'll put the, uh, a lot of this stuff away. Right, we'll get this loot and then try and deal with those zombies. We have one more forged headbook. That gives us uh, 45, so I need five more to get my chemistry station. Now we're going to try and figure out where these guys are. There's a hole there. So somehow they're glitching through here. I'm expecting to see a zombie coming up here any moment now. And they're undermining everything. Okay, let's also upgrade these as I'm going. Where's my hammer? There he is. And there we go. Whether I still hear another lot of footsteps. Same place? Yeah. Take that. So I guess that's, that's all those ones done. We'll, we'll upgrade these to cobble. This one might even go to concrete actually. Because it's a support. Same as that one. So yeah, this is another successful hood. Thank you all for watching. Please like and subscribe and we'll catch you in the next one. Thank you and goodbye.